Hi, this is Ty. I'm Rykard. I'm Shona. Hi, I'm Charlie. Hi, I'm Joss. Hi, I'm Charlotte. Hi, I'm Lee. Hi, everybody. I'm Vicky, and this is the Lazy Person's Guide to Looking Hot. Top fitness hacks if you're feeling lazy. Number one, phone a friend, see if they want to come to the gym with you. Number two, look up new motivation, whether it's a YouTube video or on social media. Go and find an Instagram account that inspires you. You maybe see someone that you think, God, oh, they're looking really good. A fitness hack if you're feeling lazy and just want to stay at home is to just do a workout at home. Have some equipment that you use, a couple of weights that you can kind of keep under your bed and get your workout on your bedroom. And also put in on some music, doing some housework, going for a walk, anything that's just going to get you up and moving. Also, get outside. Fresh air will make you feel more energetic. Exercises you can do at your desk. desk exercises. Actually, it's really, really important that people that do spend a lot of time sat down do move. So really simple things like knee raises. So raising your knee, your foot up off the floor, opposite legs. You can always do a little bum clench. Little bum clench. Little bum clench. Butt clenches, so you can just kind of squeeze your butt. You get a little bit of time, turn yourself round. Pressure, you put your arms on the back of your desk. Do a little tricep dip. You can also do squats, so standing up from your chair and then sitting back down. It's really important to keep moving all day, not just for one hour a day. So if you can, take phone calls standing up, walking around the office while you make your calls is so much better than just sitting in your chair all day on the phone. If you're watching TV, uh, a good one to do is like do some squats whilst watching TV. Also do some stretching, sitting down, stretching out your legs. You can always do glute exercises while you're watching TV. Glute bridge, you can hip thrust. Go into a plank position and hold it for the duration of the adverts if you don't like watching the adverts. If you're always hungry, check that you're not actually thirsty. A lot of the time we mistaken hunger for thirst. Your body actually sends the same signal when you're thirsty. So try to drink more water throughout the day because that might be why you're hungry. Get okay, at least two litres of water in you a day. Rather than snacking on like crisps or chocolates, fruit will win all day. I'm always hungry. Fill your plate up with things like greens. Loads and loads of broccoli, loads and loads of kale. Next to no calories, loads and loads of nutritional value. And you can have like as much as you want. I mean, just don't pick up a chocolate bar every single snack time. Common sense will tell you that that's not the right thing to do. And I think deep down, you all know the right things to be eating. Try and have fruit and nuts instead. It'll take some getting used to it first, but listen, it's a tiny change and it'll have such a radical effect on your body that you will never ever go back. Lazy people that need motivating, you are the only person that will get yourself there. I can give you the information and tell you what to do, I can scream at you, shout at you, but at the end of the day, you've got to get off your ass and do the exercise yourself. Have a specific goal, a weight, a measurement, a size that you want to be, and also take pictures as well, because this can really motivate you from where you start, where you're starting right now to where you want to be. I remember that first time that we met, that we spoke, you know, why you wanted to train? Remember that. Now let's go and train.